Hi guys, this is Ulrich today with another guitar question or um, rather my thoughts on beginners electric guitars for under $200. So if you are a guitar beginner, you want to learn electric guitar, the chances are you may already have a specific model, a specific guitar model or brand in mind, then this video is really not for you. Of course, if you go for better guitar like I'm just for example, here this is a Gibson SG61 reissue. Um, it's usually around $1,500, $1,600. Of course, that is a good beginner's guitar. The question is, do you need it? So this video is really for folks who don't have a preference per se with regard to the model or the the manufacturer and they just want to know okay I, they just know i want to learn electric guitar so help me finding a decent playable instrument ideally with some accessories to get me started for under 200 dollars. this is what this video is about so what are the best beginner's electric guitars for under 200 bucks. It's always very, very difficult to answer the what are the best questions because what I can do is merely give you my opinion. And my opinion is usually based on things that I know because what I don't want to do is just go on Amazon or on a blog or on websites and say, okay, here are 10 guitars. They all look good to me. They're all great. Those are the best 10 electric guitars for beginners. That wouldn't make sense. So what makes more sense to me is share with you from my perspective based on instruments that I played or still own what I believe are the three best electric guitars for beginners that I know of. Now, along with this video, there is an article where I introduce you to those three guitars or more specifically the guitar bundles because each of the guitars and instruments come with an amplifier, come with additional accessories such as a cable. One, um, one guitar comes with a pitch pipe, others come with an actual tuner. And all that is explained in detail for each one of my three candidates in detail on my website with price information, with purchasing information, information and so forth. Two quick points. So, so the guitars we're talking about are a, is a Davidson guitar plus accessories, an Epiphone with a, accessory, an Epiphone with accessories, and a Fender, or more specifically a Squire with accessories. The the least expensive one is the Davidson. The Davidson guitar is very similar to the one that you see here. They might actually be identical in terms of build and make. But you know, sometimes depending on, on who the distributor is, they put their brand name on there. It's essentially the same. The guitars are the same, but then they put their, their label on it. So this one goes by, I don't even know, Spectrum. The Davidson, I think the Davidson compares very well to, the, to that guitar here. And this is a guitar that we got for one of my daughters with an amp for like 150 bucks. So very similar, the Davidson guitar is a guitar that you get for under a hundred dollars with amp and all the accessories. It's a decent enough guitar to get started. You don't need a better guitar than that. You don't, again, you don't need it. You could have a better guitar, but from a, from a necessity perspective, a guitar like that will do. My guitar was was maybe $50, maybe $100, my first electric guitar. It was pretty beat up, but you know what? It was good enough for me to learn on. The second guitar we're talking about is an Epiphone guitar, a Les Paul style guitar, beautiful instrument, 200 bucks with all the accessories. Again, more on that instrument on my article. The same is true for my personal top choice, which is the Fender Squire Bullet. I do own that particular guitar in white. It comes in different colors and I can only highly recommend it for guitar beginners because you know what? It plays very well. It handles well. The sound is decent. So everything you need for very little money. Before I want you to go over on my website and read the article, one quick point and just a general remark. Um, you know, a lot of people, you will probably do some research. You're probably doing some research already on, you know, what the best, what are the best electric guitars for beginners. And I know the, the internet is full of all this advice and all these articles. And I don't mean to discredit any of those, but just be careful. Um, 
because I feel very often you find find websites and posts and blogs from uh, internet marketers and their goal is to just sell your product so they get a commission. I focus on items that I again either played, know very well or own versus rather than some jit rather than giving you like a, a generic list of the top 10 best selling uh, beginner electric guitars. Um, so I just wanted to explain my angle where I'm coming from. Everything I recommend is usually based on on a history I have with that item, whether that's a guitar, whether these are amps, accessories and whatsoever, because that's what I can truthfully speak to. Of course, there are many, there are dozens of other equally suitable guitars, but again, I can only speak to those that I actually know. So please go on my website, please click on the link here uh, somewhere, it will take you over my website, introduce each guitar and the accessories in detail, we put them side by side, we do a little head on head comparison, and then I'll give you buying and purchasing op options with links over to Amazon. Happy to answer any questions that you may have, please leave them below the video, and I'll get back to you right away. That's it for today, I'll see you in the next video, till then, bye bye. Thank you.